All right, that was just the warm up. Stay right there. MAIS is on the phone and they got an important message. Top seed at Jackson Academy taking on Jackson Prep and Madison for the state title. The Raiders have just one loss on the season. Prep looking to play major upset. This was a good one. Like Mike? No, like Mo. Mo Williams' son, Mike Williams, hits a triple late in the third to give J.A. a little breathing room with a three point lead. Jump to the fourth. It's Williams again, the nasty Euro, and finish through contact. 52 to 48 with 130 to go. Prep applying pressure. They get the turnover and Ben Seagrest with the silky finish. After another defensive stop, the Patriots can tire, take the lead. Seagrest says, give it to me. Prep goes in front by one with 34 ticks to go. Jackson Academy has to have it. Caleb Gator, he does. The tough finish on the runner. Raiders lead by one. So this is everything. And Williams gives everything. First it's on over. Coach telling him Patriots have to foul. Mike outruns them all and runs straight to the state championship. 54 to 53 in an instant classic. Now to the women's game. Could they top it? Prep again playing underdog, this time against top seeded MRA. Now Prep held a four point lead in the final seconds of the half. Tori Polk unleashing her Caitlin Clark at the buzzer. Bang. That deep three would be huge in the second half, and so was Polk. Her left-handed floater is good. The lead is nine. MRA pulls back all the way within four, and McGee Stradinger tries to shut the door. The Madison Patriots would not be dissuaded, and Anna Anderson would not be played. She was money from three all night long. It's a one-score game with two minutes to go. Now it came down to free throws. This one from Claire Crosby could shut the door on MRA's floor, stone cold. Jackson Prep upsets the one seed and wins the state title 45 to 41. All this craziness, and here's the thing, we do it all again next week with the MIS overall tournament. Now the fun's not done. Over to the land for the first round of the public school playoffs. Ridgeland already up big over Grenada. Cameron Snow's licking his chops with all that room to work. The late challenge is no problem, he's a bucket. Speaking of buckets, Phil Nelson is a fast moving locomotive and you best get out of his way. Ridgeland wins 70 to 56. Now on days like today, Joe and I get spread pretty thin. The end of Madison Central hosting South Haven. Huge shout out to Kingston Dixon for getting me a big bucket with six seconds left so we have at least one highlight for y'all. Jaguars win 62 to 42 and advance.